excuse me, but this room is occupied. You all right? Of course. Why aren't you back at the party? Some of the girls are organizing a wet t-shirt contest, which I imagine is pretty much your idea of heaven on earth. Yep. Been there, done that, got the t-shirt. Quite literally sometimes. Mm, oh, you're so not the person I need to talk to you right now. I was here first, so if you want to hide, maybe you better find somewhere else. What makes you think I'm hiding? No. See you later, Flynn. It's not Arab's fault. Simon's is kryptonite. She gets to him. She's just got this way of knowing exactly how to push his buttons. Of course, you think what he's done is okay. No, I think he's totally out of order. Guess I was just trying to cheer you up. I feel so, so stupid. I really need to work in this whole cheating up thing, huh? <laughs> Can't cry. I think I've got monopoly and being morose around here. Huh? Thinking about her and him, both of them together. Hmm. Not sure that's a mental image I cling to. Maybe it's just sex. Maybe I need to get out of the system. And I should be okay with that? Ah, oh, Flynn. You know a lot about sex, but you know nothing about love. Have you ever met someone that you wanted to see in the morning? Never mind to actually talk to or care about. When I was 10, I had a really big crush on Britney Spears. She was kind of hot back then. You have no idea how I feel. I know exactly how you feel. The person you care about is with somebody else and it's fucking painful. Arab's my best mate, but he's an idiot. And if he does choose Simon over you, he'll get everything he deserves. Because being more is pretty much the worst punishment I can think of. <laughs> and even worse, he'll wake up one morning and realize he's lost you. That he had the chance to be with someone who's kind and funny. And he always sees the best in people, no matter how shitty or grubby they are. And he blew it. And you kick himself every day for knowing that he let someone so lovely slip away. You think I'm lovely? No, I think you're annoying and, and preachy and into things. Yeah.